guys, it's Monday. This is my friend Molly. She's joining me because it's President's Day and we're both off from school and we're currently baking cookies. Button cookies. But yeah, they're called <laughs> button cookies. Button cookies. I don't say it wrong. <laughs> President's Day, since Dana was a terrible American citizen and didn't actually know whose birthdays we're celebrating, it's a combination of George Washington and Abraham Lincoln's because George Washington's is tomorrow and Abraham Lincoln's was like two days ago, two weeks ago. Larissa, you're... We, we are definitely in sync. The John Green quote is, I love that one. I want it to be like on my bedroom wall. And we actually have English essays a lot like yours did, um, because our common essays are stupid and weird and don't allow us to have sources or anything on it. Only with like one of the English teachers, our school does book rights where you have the book and then you write about it. The rest of them are just sort of like do a project for it or answer these questions on your book. It's just basically it to prove that you've read the book. Yeah. Also, the Wizard Rock show you went to, I know you mentioned your video and then you post pictures of it on Facebook. I am so ridiculously jealous. There's a picture of Alex Carpenter biting her hat because she wore the wolf hat. Can I live in California? Like yeah, let's Because the tour to Nerd 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 went there. Yes. Should like, sure, I go to that too? Stupid Midwest. I don't no. know. And it's cold. And too. they have In-N-Out Burger. Well, you don't eat burgers. So well, yeah, but like still, it. like I want the opportunity. Alex, you asked what we were giving up for Lent. I don't give things up for Lent because I'm a horrible Catholic. Do you know what she's giving up for Lent? She's giving Lent up. I'm going to have to use that. <laughs> so I think I have confirmation in like a week or yeah. two. Do you know what I'm giving up for Lent? Nothing, I'm Methodist. Alex, you're also talking about Pancake Day. You should totally make pancakes on Pancake Day. I've actually requested that my mother let me have pancakes on Pancake Day. Let so... me. Shut up, oven. Pancake Day is actually called either Fat Tuesday or Mardi Gras here in the United States. Because most... We're fat. Most people get drunk on it, and since I'm not old enough to drink, don't really do anything for it. Sam, I'm sorry your Wi-Fi's broken. Uh, uh, my internet was being stupid earlier this year. Weeping. Weeping in the fetal position. Yeah, basically. Forever. So you don't get a punishment because Wi-Fi being broken is under technical fault. Dana, you said that your school only lets you have like all honors or no honors, and I think that's ridiculously stupid because being good at like math and science is not always the same people who are good at English. And I'm really glad my school doesn't do it that way. Oh yeah. <laughs> also, your school, your on A level honors fit people being cute and adorable sounds like a lot of fun. What is your first one? I I skip around. I thought you said President's Day already. I did. All hunger sounds stupid. What does that sound? Oh about? honors. Oh honors. You said that already. Yeah. Yeah. So the next one. Well, is I haven't hurting. finished that thought. Okay, go ahead. Small yeah. school. You haven't talked about small schools yet. Her honor because. They're a level honors people. Yeah. And because there's it's such cute. A, Yeah, it was adorable. And okay. but because she was talking about how she thinks honors uh, small schools are like more fun or she likes them, how her school is small, but I also like which and it's cute, but I like larger schools because it gives you the opportunity to be friends with more people. So small schools are bad? Well they're not bad. They're not so, I mean that's where I'm going to SES. As large schools. Yeah, that's why I'm going why to Why are you SES. going to SES? Because you you can do more stuff because it's a smaller school and they're more able to specifically do what you need to do, whereas okay. like large schools and also it's SES and they go on cool field trips. Dude, no edge. <laughs> Are you gonna let me do my video? Yeah. <laughs> Dana, you were talking about how you don't eat meat in general, but you get really annoyed at people who are whining on Fridays because aren't allowed to eat meat. I do not eat meat. Well, oh. <laughs> <laughs> what the heck was that? <laughs> Liar. You're. Tell her of them truth, your pants are ablaze. Gosh, that was the most blatant lie I've ever heard you tell. I misspoke. I do eat meat, and I actually do not even stop eating meat on Fridays because... It's because you eat so much meat. <laughs> you eat meat for lunch and I for don't dinner. eat meat for breakfast. Well, yeah, because it's breakfast. Well, yeah, most people eat bacon. Ew. I love Who bacon. Eat bacon for breakfast? Bacon is a breakfast food. No. Yeah. During Lent, I still eat meat on Fridays, even though I'm Catholic and I'm not supposed to eat meat on Fridays. Um, mostly because I just like meat, and when I did eat school lunches, all the good school lunches were meat ones. And also the history behind it. Originally it was you could you could not eat meat on any Fridays, and that was actually because in like, I think it was the 13th century? Or might have been the 16th? I don't know. And then a bunch of fishermen went to like the Vatican and be like, well, we're not getting enough money, can you make people eat fish more? And they're like, okay. So they mandated that you couldn't eat like meat on Fridays. And then that's why they have to eat, that way they have to eat fish on Fridays to basically increase the fishermen's 
for uh, money making because then they would donate more to the diocese. So it's economic, not yeah. religious. Larissa, I actually really like talking to you because Alex's video was late and because of technology issues. So I was, uh, it was sort of nice getting to talk to a new person for once. Um, not that I, that sounds like I just like you, <laughs> Alex. I'm sorry. Go, go ahead and offend everyone. <laughs> just. Take the whole Larissa, paper. Alex, Sam, they're not just. Consider yourself offended. <laughs> You're laughing at me as I dig my grave, aren't you? You're a horrible person. Yep, and that's why you love me. Like, well, I I missed your videos. I think it was it was nice to talk to Larissa for once. Um, so I was thinking maybe at some point in time we should have a week where we mix up our orders, where we can all talk to different people. Oh, and I made running crew, so if I miss my video next week, that's why because I am backstage in Flax doing stuff. You guys, DFTBA and Alex, I will see you tomorrow. Ch -ch -ch. Yeah. <laughs>